Is that okay. working there? You guys can see that? Yes, we see it. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm not going to change it to presenter mode because when I do that, I lose my ability to see everyone on the screen. Um, okay. So if, if that's all right, I'll leave it like this. Um, but it's very nice to see everyone. My name is Nicole Laporte. I'm a manager at BDO Charlottetown office, and I have joining me my colleague, Miles Grant. Hi, everyone. Uh, I'm an intern at BDO Charlottetown office, and I'm also a student at UPI. Uh, majoring in business. Um, so today, Miles and I are going to go over a bit about um, what BDO is, who we are, um, the student support that BDO offers, as well as career opportunities that we have available for students. Um, so BDO Canada has been um, providing assurance, accounting, tax, advisory services to a broad range of clients across Canada for over 100 years. Uh, we typically look for students in an accounting uh, related field, whether it's accounting specifically or um, business, uh, finance, mathematics, those types of degrees. Although if that's not the field of study that you're in now, um, definitely don't count yourself out. Um, myself, I spent two years uh, working towards a biology degree before I switched to accounting, so it's never too late to switch if you're interested. Um, so on this slide here, there are some stats about BDO Canada in general. Um, we are an international firm too, so we do have connections to over 160 countries around the world. In PEI specifically, we have two offices, one in Charlottetown and one in Summerside, and I'd say probably about 50 staff at the moment. Uh, BDO Canada has won uh, quite a few awards. Um, in particular, most recently, we are uh, we have a spot among Canada's top 100 employers for 2023, which is pretty exciting. Um, to explain to you all about why BDO is a great place to work, I thought Miles and I would both share a little bit about our experiences at BDO. Um, so for myself, I graduated from UPEI in 2018 with my bachelor's in business and an accounting specialization. Um, I started at BDO right after graduation, and I've, so I've been there for about five years. When I started at BDO, I was um, a junior accountant, and I've worked my way up to the manager position I'm in now. So the opportunity for career progression has been really something um, positive for me that I think is a really big plus for BDO. Um, as new graduates, you also get a taste of a lot of different types of work. So to skip ahead for one sec to this slide, there are a lot of different areas of focus that you could um, focus on with your work at BDO and as a new hire you get to experience all of these things and really decide what what type of work excites you and what you enjoy doing which is another thing that I found to be really positive about my experience um, and maybe I'll let Miles you go ahead and talk about yours Miles mixed, missed picture day so he doesn't have a headshot but that's okay <laughs> <laughs> yeah it's uh... <laughs> Too bad, but uh, I'm actually a second year business student uh, specializing in accounting uh, as well. It's my plan uh, at UPI, and I've been working at BDO since the summer of 2022. Uh, I've been interested in accounting uh, for quite some time, and thanks to BDO, I've been able to gain plenty of valuable work experience uh, in the field of accounting. So my managers and partners have been really supportive of my education and they also give me the flexibility to work as a part-time student during school which is great and full-time during the summers overall bdo has been excellent to me and it's been a great place to work for a business student and i've just seen firsthand how much working here has benefited me for both my studies and my career awesome thanks miles um so a couple other things that make BDO unique, and some of them we've already touched on, are the career development opportunities, um, professional development, especially for students. We provide a lot of um, education opportunities, um, conferences that you can travel to. I know in my first year, I got to go to a training session in, in Niagara, which is pretty cool. And um, in a couple of weeks, I'm going to go to Montreal for another training session. So lots of cool training opportunities. Um, because we are a global firm, we do offer um, secondments in other areas of the world. So one of our colleagues just got back from a two-year um, secondment in England. Um, we do offer uh, one paid volunteer day a year for our staff because giving back is really important. 
Um, we usually do something all together as an office, so it's a really fun bonding experience too. Uh, BDO also prioritizes well-being. Um, one example of that is we have a, it's called a do what you love reimbursement. And the amount depends on what level you're at within the firm. But we have had new staff who have been able to um, pay for a flight to Toronto for a concert or um, concert tickets in Moncton or just something fun that you can do for your PTO, something that you love that BDO will reimburse for you. Um, BDO has lots of flexibility options. So um, really generous personal time off plans, um, extra long weekends. If a holiday is on a Monday, typically our office will close on the Friday to make it an extra long weekend, which is great. Um, a hybrid approach, so flexibility in how you work. For example, I'm working from home today, so I didn't have to um, go too far away from my bed to work, which is nice. And also a dress for your day policy. So maybe there are days where you're meeting with a client and you're really dressed up, but if you are just planning a work from your desk day, maybe you can dress down a little bit. Uh, we do offer a lot of student support if you're thinking about doing your CPA designation after you graduate from UPEI. Um, BDO will pay for your CPA courses, which is fantastic because those can get quite pricey. Um, lots of paid time off to do your studying. Um, preparation for the tests in the form of um, study programs that BDO will pay for to help you succeed in your exams and things like that. Um, opportunities at BDO. So we do have, um, there are QR codes here on the screen for the 2024 positions we have available for new students. Um, in general, we usually have a few co-op students or summer students, um, as well as we hire fresh out of university. Um, and, and kind of the, the process of what that looks like is you could apply online or through the links in these QR codes. And then your application would be reviewed by our, our recruitment teams. And at that point, they would probably invite you for an interview with the local team here in PEI. Or you could always send your resumes directly to um, employees that you know to share with the local partners. So I think after this presentation, my email will be shared or perhaps the slide deck too. So you guys will have access um, to communicate with us at any time. Um, or you could connect with us online uh, via our website, LinkedIn, or Instagram, or anything like that. Um, and happy to answer any questions that have come up in the chat as we've been talking. I did see one about what BDO stands for. Um, and I'm really glad someone answered that because I did not know the answer to that question. <laughs> so thank you very much. Wonderful. Um, Thank you very much, uh, Nicole, for your presentation. Uh, yeah. Very nice overview of uh, the opportunities at BDO. Um, yeah, one fact I did, yeah. sorry to Go interrupt, ahead. one fact I forgot to mention is that BDO does hire international students if they have a valid um, work permit. So I know some of you may be wondering that. Wonderful, thank you. Yes, uh, very relevant uh, a, a topic there for international students. We, we, we do have uh, quite a number of international students joining us today during this presentation. So thank you very much for sharing that. Yeah, thank um, you. We do, have a, we do have a couple of questions here. So first one is what qualifications of candidates does BDO need? So basically the, the typical profile of the uh, of a strong applicant and yeah. does BDO hire um, veterans? Um, so for the typical qualifications, you don't need any pre previous experience in accounting. I didn't when I got hired. Um, so typically what we look for are the things that on the screen here, like the soft skills, um, professionalism, um, it, your ability to collaborate, that you have problem solving skills, time management, those type of, types of things. So there's no, um, I guess, rule book for the, the things that you need to be able to work at BDO. Um, we enjoy having a variety of skills in the workplace, but those are the, the key ones that we do look for in applicants. Um, in terms of hiring veterans, um, I would say yes, like there's no, um, no reason why we wouldn't really, if that's, if I'm understanding the, the question, um, does BDO hire people with disabilities? Absolutely. We have an accommodation policy. Um, so for sure still apply, uh, no matter what type of barrier you see, we're definitely able to work with you. 
Wonderful. Thank you very much, yeah. Nicole. Um, we still have um, a, a, one more minute for questions here. I talk uh, fast. <laughs> no, that's okay. Um, so if we have any other question, uh, feel free to send it through the, through the chat. If not, we could um, move forward to the next presentation. Okay, wonderful. Um, I see no other much. questions. So thank you very much, Nicole. Thank and you. Miles for joining us. Uh, wonderful presentation and great to see there the